What's up you guys? Just withdrew some money from the bank, just left town on the way to pick up some new rims and tires for the C10. Uh, but originally I was going to order some Detroit steel wheels. Yeah, I'm real fond of that style, the big steelies. It's like, to me, it's like a perfect in between of that old school style mixed with new school. I don't know, it's just, the Detroit steel wheels are great. And that's probably the way I would want to go if I had an unlimited budget, but I don't, so I'm going the next best thing. I was going to make it a surprise, but probably by the description or the title of this video, you already know that I'm going to pick up some transport steel wheels, which are 22 inch steelies. I was going to get 20 inch Detroit steel wheels, but uh, all the transports are 22 inch, if you don't know, they're actually, were originally put on trucks for when they're coming off the assembly line to transport them to wherever they're going to be sold. So they weren't even actually ever sold on trucks. They're actually for transport. So, but they're actually really big and popular now. Um, I found a deal on the set with brand new tires about an hour out of town. So that's what we're doing now. Stay tuned. We're gonna pick them up and hopefully get them on the truck today. But yeah, we'll see. I think but it seems kind of empty let's see 1542 1540 is what we want next one or is it behind us Let's see. Just made it here and I think it's back behind this gate so I'm gonna give the dude a message and maybe he'll let me in or bring him out. But I'll see you in a second with some rims and tires. All right, so he said he's out front. I'm not sure if I was supposed to go through that gate or not, but yeah, I think so. This is it. Here we are. These people are doing some badass shit in here. I don't know if you can see that C10. In there. Looks like they have all kinds of cool shit getting built, but. Got our wheels. I was almost going to go in there and see if I can get some footage of that truck for you guys, but to be honest, I wasn't really sure. They had a bunch of guys walking up to look at the truck right now, and they had a camera too. Like maybe they had some YouTube stuff going on. I don't know, but that thing was badass. Pro Voss Motorsports in Woodland. This shit looks pretty tight in there. Well, we got our rims and tires, guys. Now, journey back to Orville. I'm probably trying to get these rims and tires on today. We'll see you in a bit. Time to try a new taco spot. Passing through Knight's Landing. 
seen a taco truck I haven't tried, you know we gotta stop. Brand new tires. See if these are good or not. Brand new tires. We're not gonna mount them all today, but we're gonna mount this one. To see how it looks. Um, yeah, so let's get this rim and tire off, pop it on there, get a little look at how it's gonna be. For the record, I do like the rims and tire setup that are currently on the truck, but I just want to switch it up. I love the look of the big steelies. So those rims and tires currently on the truck aren't going anywhere. So I'm going to put them up and if I ever want to switch it up, I could throw them back on if I want. There she is, guys. Those wheels are heavy. Like I said, those wheels aren't for everybody, but I personally like them a lot. Those things are heavy. I think it looks pretty good. I'm pretty juiced. Twenty twos.